friends, welcome to my Terry Joe is on the go series. Today we are at the French Quarter in Charleston, South Carolina, and we're looking at the Charleston City Market, which is located at Market and Meeting Streets. Please pardon the rotten traffic, <laughs> but I'm just panning the Charleston City Market. Yeah, she said this all used to be open, but this is the only part that is now. And this is an open area of Charleston City Market. My understanding is it all used to be open. But as you can see, much of the city market is closed in now. And we've got brick and mortar. And here, one of the things that Charleston is known for is the drawn horses or horse and carriage, if you will. Standing on South Market Street, more specifically South Market and State Street, and this is a typical scene on an afternoon in Charleston, South Carolina. Again, we are in the beautiful French Quarter, and the backdrop is Charleston City Market. Oh, the horse and carriage. This is Old South Carriage. Isn't that horse beautiful? The city market was established in the 1790s and stretches four city blocks from Market Hall, which faces Meeting Street, through a series of one-story market sheds the last of which ends at East Bay Street. This is the front entrance of the Charleston City Market. I'm standing at the intersections of Market and Meeting Streets. To my left is North Market and to the right is South Market. So let's go take a look, see friends. All right, friends, we've just entered Charleston City Market and a lot of uh, nice things here. One of the things that I really like are these baskets. Oh my, they are beautiful. And where would we be without a little doggy dog at the Charleston City Market? Well, hello there, Mr. Doggy Dog. <laughs> yes, it is. Thank you. Very nice. Charleston City Market established in eighteen oh seven. Interesting salt and pepper holders. Now these baskets, just like the baskets that I was looking at when I first came in, they're handmade. That's why they're so expensive. They can take up to six weeks just to make a single basket. 
That's right, friends. Five to six weeks to make a smaller basket. That's what the man said. And smaller basket. Okay. That is $195. $175. But I saw one at the front entrance that was $630. So there it is, friends. And we're about to head into the second building of Charleston City Market. There's the entrance there. And we have a bit of a view there of North Market. I've even seen Jim Moore, uh, the doors of Jim Moore's house on Ian Asbury in front of the door. And this is my take from the Charleston City Market. Both of these adorable boxes were purchased from the next stand. Building number three, friends. An artist at work. Building number four. Friends, we have reached the end of the Charleston City Market. <laughs> oh my goodness. And here we are coming out at East Bay Street. So we started at Meeting and ended at East Bay Street. <laughs> 